Yo, what's up guys, Kevin here. Today up in Whistler, and I'm testing out the new Capita DOA. As you guys know, I've been talking about this board for a while, and today, perfect early season free ride conditions to put this board to the test. First and foremost guys, turning on this board, you really feel the camber come into a play. As you go around each turn, the camber helps to give you stability and control, especially at high speeds. And that turning feeling, definitely more geared toward intermediate or advanced riders. Riding this board at high speeds gave me a lot of control, really snappy between turns, and just overall giving me that high performance feeling. Next up, and something that's really important for me for a free ride board, is how much snap and pop I can get for an ollie. And this board definitely delivers what I expected. Because of the mid flex of this board, it really allows you to load up the tail, pop a clean and high ollie, and just feel in control and balanced in the air. And then on top of that, for the landing, when you start to put down your tail, that mid flex actually allows the board to come down nice and smooth, giving you a controlled landing as well. So for ollies, for pop, for landings, I'm absolutely loving this board. Definitely delivering what I expected. An unexpected bonus feature of this board is how pressable it is. The last board I was on, the Capital Horoscope, very soft board, easy to flex. And on this one, because of the mid flex, I was expecting it to be a bit more difficult. But because of that slight rocker towards the nose and tail, it's very easy to press, get into a tail press, or even go for a butter. So something I love to do while free riding is just get into some fun butters, and this board definitely allows you to do that. Up here in Whistler, we did have some fresh snow and I did take it into the powder. Definitely not this board's strength. For riding through the powder, I had to get way onto the back foot to keep the nose up. So not the easiest board for powder riding, but it still got the job done. Awesome guys, so overall, I'm super stoked on this new Capita DOA. I think this is gonna be my go-to board for the rest of the season, for park, for free riding. If you guys have any questions about it, definitely leave them down below. I'll do more tests on this board in the future, so give this video a thumbs up if you guys wanna see more tests on the Capita DOA. I'll also put a link in the description to where you can check this board out. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have fun with your riding. I'll see you in the next video soon.